I am Alberto Sánchez Pascuala. I am working as a postdoctoral researcher in the Max Planck Institute for Terrestrial Microbiology in Marburg, Germany. We, as the Max Planck Institute for Terrestrial Microbiology, pursue to understand how the microorganisms deploy their function in the environment. In order to achieve this goal, we employ approaches that are covering from the molecular to the ecosystem level. The microbial diversity is immense, motivated by the evolutionary pressure. The microorganisms have created an enormous amount of strategies in order to survive in the dynamic environment. The deep characterization of this phenomena brings a promising opportunity to shed light on different basic and applied research topics. In our department of biochemistry and synthetic metabolism, we focus on the discovery, understanding, and engineering of novel enzymes and pathways, especially those that capture and convert the carbon dioxide. We are looking for synthetic alternatives that work more efficiently than the naturally evolved ones. For example, a synthetic photosynthesis that bins CO2 more efficiently and thus could reduce the excess of the greenhouse gas. In order to achieve this goal, we study the function and organization of promising natural metabolisms in the context of the living cells, taking advantage about the natural diversity. Afterwards, we deeply characterize the molecular basis of catalysis for these pathways, being able to optimize or rewrite their enzymatic capabilities. Taking into account all this generated knowledge, we can realize novel synthetic pathways, not constrained by the evolutionary timeline. To conclude, our group keep an eye on the implementation of these synthetic pathways in more complex cellular systems such as natural and artificial cells for example, plant, bacteria, or artificial chloroplast. In order to embrace all these objectives, we are conducting research at the interface between microbial physiology, biochemistry, and synthetic biology. The generation of biological standards is essential in order to achieve our mentioned goals. For example, the genetic standardization of genes involved in our synthetic pathways makes them compatible with a large number of genetic standards, cloning, mobilization, and expression systems. This is very useful for facilitating the daily life in our laboratory, at the same time that allows the easy sharing of material with other research groups. Now, it is time to take inspiration from the nature in order to guarantee a sustainable future for the herd and all its inhabitants.